low class. Hello. How are you? It happened the same, right? Pasó lo mismo. No pudieron accesar Hi. antes, Oti. Good evening, teacher. No, no pudimos entrar I, antes. I don't know no why. sé por qué. You know, I Good, was evening. Even, Good evening to everyone. I was even checking porque la clase anterior la tengo con el mismo usuario de Zoom y con los demás, créanme, una hora antes se conectan. Y yo, wow, ¿qué hacen conectados tan temprano? Right? I don't know why. ¿Por qué, ¿Por qué nos están castigando a nosotros? No, I don't know why. <laughs> Sí, es cierto, estábamos la, hablando de que ya teníamos... Es la misma configuración, es la misma configuración, fíjate, eso, I don't know why. But I'm going to ask. con Paola, ¿qué pasó ahí? ¿Qué pasó, Paola? No, Ajá, Paola. supuestamente a Paola Iglesias tendríamos que preguntarle. You can, of course, no you can ask her. No you está ahorita aquí, ¿verdad? No, she's no? not. Where no is está. No, she's no. not here. No. Come on. Supuestamente debe de estar... No, Porque si le, hablamos, si le preguntamos a, a Jason, Jason, él, él sí no está. No, but Jason is from another course. Right now, Paola is the one who is helping here. Yeah, so. Okay. Yeah, she's always joining. Sí, siempre viene. Siempre viene a observar la clase. So, probably if she okay. comes, we can ask her. Right. So, don't forget to have your cameras on. Cameras on, please. So, uh, there we have, there we have it. Uh, Karen, hi Karen, Karen Murillo. We have a question. Hola Karen. Karen Murillo, hello. Oh. <laughs> ya ve qué es lo que le digo que no está es que le cambió el nombre por eso ah that's why, right. <risa> so, tengo. hola ah. yo soy de soporte técnico bien solo una consulta me pasa con este grupo que si yo no inicio la sesión ellos no pueden ingresar antes a la clase es probable que usted tenga otra sesión antes de esta no sé si me equivoco eh, sí bueno, en ese caso, como su correo es compartido a la cuenta, es por eso que no puede ingresar. Pero Solo hasta que... Ah, ok. Entonces, so that's why. Esa es la razón. No es porque se porten mal, chicos. No. That's the reason, then. Pero así no. entramos la... la Mira el, el pobre César. Ah, Ajá, pensar, y en el módulo anterior pensar. estuvimos así. Karen, ¿no podemos arreglar ese voladito? No, no, no. We cannot. That's right. That's it. Esa oh, es la razón. Okay. Es una respuesta lógica. Muy bien. Pero sí, chicos. Hoy fue un minuto. So don't worry. Relax. I know you're so punctual. Son bien puntuales. Eso me encanta. So that's why. That's the reason why. So you see, she's gone. <laughs> ya se fue. <laughs> Así. Solo entran un minutito, dos. Para ver si todo está bien. Pero esa es la razón principal. So class. Let's start right now. I'm still missing Gabriela, Brian, and Stephanie, Jasmine, and Anna Gabriela, right? Cameras on, please. Recuerden el compromiso que hicimos ayer. Ustedes mismos indicaron las reglas de clase. Class, what were we practicing yesterday? First class, yesterday. What was the topic from yesterday? Who can tell me? Mm -hmm. What was the topic from yesterday? You don't remember. Conversation where ah, are you exactly. from? It's a conversation asking about the country and asking about the name of people. The and nickname. We were, the nickname, exactly. Please call me and then we were expressing nicknames right so as i mentioned yesterday that was the first part so of the conversation so for today class number two let me show you the topic for this class here we go let me see class number two 
Okay. Ahí estamos. We are still in section number one. Please call me Beth. And the topics that we have for today are possessive adjectives, WH questions with verb to be, and also yes, no questions with B. Remember that this is a review of topics that we already covered, right? But in the case that you still have questions, comments about topics, that's why we are giving a second chance so we can cover all of this information. Section number one, tomorrow and Thursday, we are going to cover section number two, right? So before we start with the class, let me ask you, bird to be, what is the bird to be? In the simple present form. I, you, I, I am, is, am, are. Are, are. So what does it mean? Vamos a crear preguntas, interrogative sentences with am, is, and are. Right? Dos tipos diferentes de preguntas. WH questions and yes no questions so those are the topics for today but first let's go back to the conversation right let's go back to the conversation here we have the conversation this is the first part of the conversation and let's have the second one but let me do some okay Take a look at the second part. Okay, remember that we were discussing about the name of people, nicknames, and we were giving a comment about the country. I love Mexico, it's really beautiful. Thanks, so is Brazil. That was the end of the first part of the conversation. So as you may see, second part of the conversation, Beth, and David, they are talking about another girl. Look, ya están hablando de otra chica, right? Ya no hablan de su información personal. They talk about a different girl. So the conversation goes like this. Oh, good. Son, he is here. Who's son, he? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Garcia. Actually, it's Garza. How do you spell that? G-A-R-Z-A. -A. So that is the conversation. Right, so we need to practice as well, giving this personal information. But let's do something. Instead of saying son he, cambiamos este nombre. Demo un nombre más fácil de pronunciar. We better not say son he. Give me a girl's name, or it can be also a boy's name. Glenda. Okay. Glenda. That's right, Glenda. Thank you. So, oh, good. Glenda is here. Who's Glenda? Let me ask you, who's Glenda? Who's Glenda? Cesar. Who's Glenda? This is Love the Caesar. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's my the beautiful girl, my class. <laughs> so is she your classmate? Ay, Glenda, contestale, no seas cruel. So she is my classmate. We are in the same English class, math class. Where is she from? But look, 
I need you to look that we are using contractions a lot, short forms. Es bien necesario que nos acostumbremos a las short forms in English. Who's, she's, where's, she from, what's, your last name again, it's. Look, we have all of these contractions or short forms. So remember to pronounce contractions correctly, right? So who's, and then we say the people's name. She's my classmate. We're in the same math class, but I really need you to be ready to spell your last name, right? ¿De quién es ese apellido? ¿De quién será ese apellido? Garza. David. David. David, right? If you see, si se fijan, empiezan a hablar de son he, pero luego se pasan a otro tema. Sorry, what's your last name again? García, sorry. What's your last name again? Sometimes it is very easy to forget people's name. It's so common. In my case that I have so many students, you know, I tend to forget people's last name, maybe not names, but last name. So there is always a question that we can use. Cuando se nos olvide el apellido o nombre de alguien, please, no sean tan obvios y digamos, uh, what's your name? O cuál es tu nombre? No. ¿Por qué? Porque denotamos que no prestamos atención a las personas o no es tan polite. It's very unprofessional and unpolite to say that. We instead say, what is your last name again? Hey, what is your last name again? Okay, wait, last name. Así. What is your last name again? Oh, is Argeta. Oh, thank you. What is your cell phone number again? Oh, it's 701-335-2446. It's an example, right? So what is, what is your? So let's see, let's practice. ¿Qué si se me olvidó? Veamos. La dirección de la persona. How do I make the question? ¿Cómo le pregunto su dirección again? Uh -huh. what, is, what is your address? Oh, what is your address? What is your address again? Very good job. What if I forgot the cell phone number? Cell phone number. Make the question, please. What is your cell phone what is your number? Phone number? Again. What is your cell phone number again? I forgot the email address. Address. Mm -hmm. Email address. What is your email address your again? Email address very again. good. What's your email address again? I forgot. Uh, ¿Qué más se nos puede olvidar? Veamos. What else? Maybe your job or profession? The or age. occupation? Llamémosle yeah, occupation, tal vez. Mm -hmm. When we want to refer to what do people do? Para preguntar qué hacen. Sorry, what is? How do you do? Mm -hmm. Or what, what, where do you work again? No solo podemos ocupar what. Or what do you do again, right? So we can sound more natural. That is the purpose, right? So let's practice right now. Here we go with the conversation. Let's try, do I have volunteers? I need two volunteers. So we can have this exercise right now. Volunteers, here we go. Remember, try to participate. Sometimes this is the only time for you to practice English. 
I only have Elvis. So Elvis, please tell me one of your classmates' names. Pick one of your classmates. Elija uno de sus compañeros. Here you Glenda. have 22. Who? Glenda. Okay, let's go. Vamos, empecemos la conversación. Here we go. Oh, good. ¿Cómo se llama? Uh, oh, good, Elvis. Is here. Who's mm he? -hmm. She's my classmate. We're the same main class. Where's she from? Korea, left. Go and say hello, sorry. What's your last name again? Garcia. Actually, it's Garza. How do you spell that? G A R Z A. Okay. Please, Elvis, let's repeat this part. And try to give me your information, please. Actually, is it's it's Garza. No, but yours. But you are oh. not Elvis Garza, right? Your actually Rauda. it's Rauda. Okay. How do you spell that? R R A U D A. That's okay. Very good job. Go, Cesar and Aleli. You can participate now. Oh, girl. Soon he is here. What is soon here? She's his classmate. We are in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your... What's your last name again, Garcia? Yeah, actually, it's Ramirez. How? How do you spell that? R A M E M. <laughs> <laughs> Es que mi nombre, mi apellido es largo. R. Oh, come on. R. A. M. 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 La, la I no me acuerdo. A. A. M. R. E. Z. Z. So let's do something. I'm going to give you one minute, please. To yourself, a ustedes mismos, practice spelling your last name. Practiquemos deletreando su apellido ahorita. Your first last name. Ahí a ustedes mismos. So, we can continue with this exercise, right? How do you spell your last name? Practice right now. Okay. There we go. The question is, how do you spell your last name? And then you spell your last name. Are you ready to continue? So while you practice, look, please do not confuse these two expressions in English. God is something different from good. God, good, right? So, oh, ¿cómo empezamos la conversación? Oh, good or oh, God? Oh, oh, good. Oh, good. 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 Oh, good. Good. Oh, good. 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 Is he as good. Good. Good is bien. God is Dios. That's okay. That's it. Okay. That's mm -hmm. And also, siempre se escribe con mayúscula inicial. God. Para it's not like that, it's like God. Cuando hablamos de Dios, right? Cuando hablamos de Dioses, is always in 
lowercase. So, this is just extra information. So let me have, let me see. Veamos. It is Elena. Tell me. Yeah? Yes, Cesar. Very good job or no? Okay. Uh, it is. Tell me a number from one to ten. Um eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hey, Gabriel Alicet, tell me a number from one to ten. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Carlos Eden. So Gabby and Carlos Eden, it's your time to practice. Here we go. Go, please. Okay. Oh, good. Song he is here. Who's Song he? She's my classmate. We're okay. in the same math class. Where's she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again, Garcia? Actually, it's Garza. How do you spell that? G A R C A. Okay, now, Carlos, with your last name, please. Vamos a reemplazar Garza using your last name. Here we go. Okay. R E B A R A. Mm -hmm. You know? Don't you worry, let's practice. Creo que se nos olvidaron esas vowel sounds. Let's go back. Para eso estamos repasando. ¿Ven? A. A as in apple. A. A. Then we have E. E. I. O. And U. Remember. How do you read this in English? ¿Cómo leen esto? Email. email. Okay. No decimos email. No, we say email. Right. How do you read this expression in English? I am. I am. You see, ven que ya saben cómo distinguir. E y ni. I am. We don't say E am, no. I am. Right. How do you pronounce? Veamos. Esta creo que no se confunde. Right? Oh. Esta tampoco la confundimos tan fácil. You. You. So, please, practice E and I, E and I, A, E, I, O, U, email, I am, A, E, I, O, U, A, E, I, O, U, very good job. Cristelia and Fatima, please girls, it's your time to practice. Cristelia, you're going to start. Here we go. Okay. He is. Empiezo yo. Yes. Me no. escucha. Cristelia, you're going to start. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. good. Sunhi is here. Who is Sunhi? Okay, Kristelia, yeah. continue. Who is Sunhi? Okay. She is my classmate. We're in the same class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what your last name again, Garcia? Actually, is Asensio. Right. How do you spell that? A S C E M C I O. Very good job. So let's take from one to two minutes. I need you to practice only this part, everybody. Sorry, 
What's your last name again? Garcia. Y ustedes corrigen. Actually is. How do you spell that? And then you spell. Que quiero que practiquen en grupo. Sorry. What's your last name again? Garcia. Actually is Argueta. How do you spell that? Y empiezan a deletrear. Right. Is it clear? Está claro lo que vamos a hacer. Is it clear what we are going to do? It's yes. clear. It's yes, clear. Miss. So clear, Miss. So I'm going to send you that picture to WhatsApp, but first, let's go and practice right now. I'm going to make groups of three so you can have the opportunity to practice. Here we go. Sorry, what's your last name again? And then you correct B. Here we go. Let me see. Okay, I'm just missing some people. Please go and practice with your classmates. Okay, Rajan, Iris, Ana Gabriela, Edwin, go and practice, please. There we go. Very good job. Excellent. Le apareció la invitación, Edwin. Le apareció la invitación para unirse a la sala. Sí. Bien. Ah, ok. Maybe it's your internet, right. Uno de ustedes me pregunta. ¿De qué le preguntemos? Eh, sobre el último. About the last name. Yes. Uh, ok, go and uh, check what's up right spell. now, please. Mm -hmm. Spell your last name. Yep. How do you spell your last name, eh, Carlos? Ok, my last name is. R I B E R A Rivera. That's, that's okay. Uh, okay. What's uh, your last name, Brian? How do you spell that? R A U D A. Rauda. Okay. Uh, my turn. Sorry, yeah. what's your last name again? My last name is Vidaure. Oh, how do you spell that? V I D A U R E. Nice. It's a bit difficult. <laughs> Hello. 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 Uh, my name or my last name? Both. Both. Okay. My name is Emerson. E M R. Pardon. E M E R S O M. My last mm -hmm. name is M E J I A. Good. Si quieren empecemos con la captura de la de la milla la mando. Puede ser.
Great. So time to come back. Teacher, um, yes. como que necesitamos eh, repasar el alfabeto. I guess you need to. You know, this is like to go back to basic one. Es como irnos de regreso al inicio de todo el curso. But don't worry. De eso se trata, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. English, if you don't practice, you forget what you have learned. And remember one of the purposes of this course. La mayoría dijo ese propósito ayer. I need to master what I have learned. Lo que ya aprendí, pero si ya se me olvidó. Yeah, se me olvidó. Repasar, practice and practice over and over. Right? Así que si ustedes ya se dieron cuenta que es el alfabeto, lo que me está fallando, ¿qué hago? I go back and I practice again. Right? So, there are no excuses. We need to practice more. So, um, Ana Karina, what was your last name again? Garcia? No. <laughs> Actually, it's Oriana. Okay, and how do you spell that? O R I L L A M A. Okay, O R E E. Acuérdense, email, email. Sorry. Right, very good job. Daisy Magdalena, what was your last name again? Garcia? Actually, it's Hernandez. And how do you spell that? H E R N A N D E Z. Great job, excellent. Right. Edwin Ernesto, what was your last name again, Garcia? Uh, actually, Mendez. And how do you spell that? M E N D E C. Great job, great pronunciation. So, uh, what is the meaning of actually? ¿Qué significa actually? What is that? Realmente. Realmente. Exactly. No digamos actualmente, no. Es en realidad, actually. So, there we go. Excellent practice. Spelling names. But in this case, we need to spell last name. So if you see, one of the topics for today, it is to make questions. Dijimos que vamos a hacer, let me see, let me go back. Yes, questions, not affirmative, no affirmativos. Pero veamos rápidamente esto. Possessive, adjectives, statements with verb to be. If you remember in English, we have different subjects. Different subjects. What are the subjects that we have in English? I, you, you mm -hmm. he, he, she, 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 it, 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 they, we, we, they, they, they. And if you want to include you for plural, you can also have it for singular and for plural. Yeah. So those are my, my subjects. And as you may see, we need to have a verb in order to make a sentence. I need subject, verb and complement. That is the structure, right? The formula to create a sentence. So in this case, we are going to make sentences using the verb to be. And the verb to be is am, um, is, and are. So this is the information that I need you to have in mind. Verb to be, am, um, is, and are. So as we have been practicing contractions or short forms of the verb to be are the following ones. I am, I am, your, you are, his, he is, she's, she is, it, it is, we're, we are, they are, they are, 
So, whenever I have the form of the verb to be, I can also now include the possessive, possessive adjective. They are going to indicate possessions, right? ¿Qué nos indican los possessive adjectives? ¿A qué le suena esta palabra en español? Possessive. Possession. Possession. Ajá. Entonces, si quieren una definición en in inglés, what is a possessive adjective? So, what is a possession? No es nada más algo que something that belongs to someone. Algo que le pertenece a alguien. Right? Possessive adjectives. Yes, Emerson. Teacher, puede pronunciar de nuevo el we are a contractado. We are, we are. Decimos we y luego er, we are. We are. Uh, we are there. Mm -hmm. So each subject has a possessive adjective. What is the possessive adjective for I or I am? I? Me. My. My. You. Your. Your. He. Is, is, is. De él, she, or her, she, her. Mm -hmm. her. her, it, 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 we, our, our, our. and they, they, they. they. Mm -hmm. so please don't confuse, no es el verbo to be más el sujeto, no, solo es el sujeto. Mine, otra vez, mine. ¿Qué le pertenece? Mine. Uh, I. Your. ¿Con quién va? Your. You. You. Ah, you. Muy bien. You. Con, you. con el sujeto, you. you. Kiss. He. 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 And he. Él le pertenece a his. Her. She. She. Uh, she. Very good job. She. It's. It's it. Ajá, uh -huh, from it. And also, be careful. No es que lo estemos poniendo en plural, no. Simplemente es el spelling del possessive. It is. We. We. We are. We. Mm -hmm. ¿Será we are? Uh, no. no. We no. We, our, we, we, we. our. Right? And how about their? ¿Cuál es el sujeto para their? They. They. Mm -hmm. Bien. So, no quiero que vayan a confundir la contracción del verbo to be con los possessive adjectives. Son cosas totalmente diferentes, right? Possessive adjectives, they are going to indicate possession. That something belongs to someone. So, these are the affirmative statements, but we need to make questions, right? That is the goal for today. Es nuestro propósito, hacer preguntas, to make questions, right? So, mm, let me see. Um, now we, let's move on to this one. In English, we have two types of questions. Tenemos preguntas con el verbo to be, and we also have questions with the WH words. Remember que estamos siempre, seguimos hablando de el presente o oh, de simple present. Esta estructura puede ser bien larga y compleja, but it's easy to use. Simple present tense, WH questions. Do you remember? ¿Cuáles son las WH words in English? Where, what, who, what, when, who, who. Okay, these are some examples. Uh, where, who, who, what, what and how. Where, oh. You know, we have around 10 different WH words in English. You know, tenemos alrededor de 10 WH words. 
Imagínense. Pero las más usadas son only five. Five most common WH words. ¿Qué son? What? Where? Who? Who? When? How? How? When? And which? When. Uh -huh. Estas son las más comunes. Luego tenemos which, and we have so many, I even forget about them. Son 10, exactly, but which is another one. Very good. So the most used one, WH words, are what, where, who, how, and when. So, la clave está en identify, identificar qué tipo de información voy a obtener con cada una de las WH words. Right. Miremos el primer ejemplo. Word. Where is your friend? Where is your friend? Where is your friend? ¿Qué tipo de información obtengo con esa pregunta? El lugar. De lugar, muy bien. Place. Where is your friend? So let's complete this one. Look. Place. Second example. Miren el segundo ejemplo. Who's su Jean, she's my yeah. classmate. People. Ajá, ¿qué tipo de información? Yeah. About people's information. Puede ser su nombre o información de una persona. Look at the third exercise. Let me see. Emerson, can you read exercise or example number three, please? This one. Excuse me, teacher. Can Repeat. you read the example? Just read, read. Eh, si puedo escribir un ejemplo. Leerlo solamente. Read. Uh, mm -hmm. What sell like? Mm -hmm. Así. What sell like? What sell like? ¿Y la respuesta? Eh, what's the meaning sell? Mm -hmm. Class? Ah, la it's a very exciting city. Ajá. Vamos a ver si me siguen en la pista. What's, ¿Cómo se pronunciaba esto, class? Cell light. Cell light. Cell light. Cell light. Cell light. Cell light. Ayer lo vimos, class. Cell light. Cell light. Right. Fue con ustedes, yes, no. No. No, no fue no. con el otro grupo. No. El grupo de la una. Con no. nosotros fue igual. <laughs> I teach it, I teach it. Yeah, it was not with you. You know, I have so many groups that sometimes I forget. ¿Cuál tema me you don't ahora, remember digo? this group. I don't remember this. No, es que usted es su primer clase. Tengo otro pre-intermedio, pero ya vamos por la clase 7. So, por eso. My God. Yes, so with you is the second class. How? How? How are your classes? How are your classes? They are pretty interesting. So how? ¿Qué tipo de información obtengo with how? No sé, teacher. I don't know, teacher. How? No? Gustos? En okay. español sería, ¿cómo fue tu, cómo está tu They're clase? They're pretty interesting. Oh. <laughs> okay, don't worry. Veamos si saben when. When? When is your birthday? Right. Specific? Como las fechas. Como cuando. El tiempo. Tiempo. Dates or um, even I'm places. Busy. Specific information. When? About time, of course. Sobre el tiempo. How? Mm -hmm. It can be about feelings or also a specific information. Right. So I guess I have that information right here. Let me see. I have a picture with that information. So it can be very useful. Right? ¿Qué tipo de información obtengo con cada una de las WH words? Mm, let me see. Okay, I don't have it right now, but I'm going to share with you. So la voy a enviar porque la tengo en otra carpeta. So if you see WH questions in English, 
Of course, if I have a question, I need to have an answer. Yes, Aleli. Oh, solo uh, recordarle de la lista, de pasar lista. Okay, I'm going to take it at the end. Thank you. Fernando, recuérdale. Yeah, Fernando, please. Ahí no está Fernando, right? It's not here. So, ¿qué les decía? Si tengo una pregunta, ¿qué voy a obtener después? Una respuesta. If I have a question, I'm going to get a response. So, using the WH words, with the verb to be, in this case, remember, I'm going to get responses with the verb to be. Aquí combino ambos. Where is? Who is? What is? Where are? How are and what are? Miren. WH word. ¿Qué le sigue? WH word. Plus. Ver to be. Plus. plus complement. Complement. That's it. And at the end, what do I need to add? A question mark. WH word, um, is or are, complement plus per, plus question mark. Y obtengo una respuesta afirmativa o negativa, right? He's in class. He's not in my class. She's my classmates. It's a very exciting city. We're from Brazil. They are pretty interesting and they are really nice. So let's see if we can answer this exercise. If you see, I have this short exercise here that it's a conversation as well. We have people A and people B who are having a conversation. Pregunta, respuesta, pregunta y respuesta, right? Six different exercises. Number one is already done for you. Who's that? Oh, that's Mrs. Adams. How about number two, Gabriela Lisette? What WH word podemos utilizar for, for number two? Where? Where are you? Where are she from? Okay. Where? Is where is she from? She's from San Diego. Excellent job, Carlos Eden. Please, number three. What? Very good. What? What's her name? What's her first name? Very good. It's Carolyn. Okay, Aleli, number four. Who are who are the D two student over the there? Mm -hmm. Their names are Mason and um it be their names are Mason and Eva. Okay, great. It's a bowl. Number five is for you. Where are they from? Very good. Where are they from? They are from the they from they are from Vancouver. Great job. Okay, Daisy, do you want to try with number six? Daisy? Can you try with number six, Daisy Magdalena? When are they? Okay. Look, miren qué información obtenemos. They are shy, but very friendly. How are? Ah, muy bien. One, once again. How? Será esta clase. 
How are? Like, how how are they how, like? How are they like? Shy but very friendly. Not really. Can be how they are. No. No, it's how are they like? No. Mm. Bingo, man. Look. Teacher, what are, uh, uh, what are. And there we go. Who said that? ¿Quién dijo eso? Muy observativo. What are your classmates like? What are your classmates like? Es el ejemplo. So, look at the example of the exercise. What are they like? What are they like? They are shy, but very friendly. What is your friend? Who's Su Jin? What's Su like? What are you and Vanessa from? How are your classes? What are your classmates like? Esto me gusta. Classmates like. So tell me. Yes, Aníbal. Um, a question. Please. You say uh, respond. What's the difference between respond and answer? It's just a synonym. It's a okay. synonym. Yeah? You can also say, what is your response? What is your, your answer? Right? It's the same, right? Thank so you. let's go to practice. Veamos. Let me pick somebody. Vamos a elegir a alguien. Y le voy a hacer preguntas. Let me see. Class, what his name? Hi, Emerson. What his name? Ay Dios. Ay, teacher. <laughs> pero, pero es que me apareció un mensaje. Dice que. Mi... No, don't you worry. Emerson, tranquilo. What his name? Este es para toda la clase. What his name? His name is Emerson. Thank you, Emerson. Wait, wait, wait. wait. His Emerson. Name or his name? Her name or his name? His, his name. His name. Oh. His name. His name. His name. Emerson. Emerson. Yes. Where is he from? Where is he from? I'm from Excel. No, Emerson, you don't tell me. No, no. The, okay. no. Relax. He, he is the from El Salvador. Oh, he's from El Salvador. Emerson, tranquilo, no responde. Um, <laughs> what is Emerson like? What is he like? Mm. He's shy. I like he's, he's, he's no, he's Where? like the mathematics, the numbers. No, what is he like? Listen, what is he like? He's shy. I'm friendly. He's yeah. shy. Are you shy? He, I don't he's, know. Friendly. he's friendly. Oh, he's friendly. He's friendly. Yeah. He's, he's clever. He's clever, Can clever he, guy. So what is he like? Cuando les pregunto like, no es que le gusta, es como es él. Utilizamos um, adjetivos, adjetivos. Okay, let's have a girl. She's a, she's What's Elena. Her name? Yeah. What's her name? Her name is, is Aleli. Aleli. Where is she from? She from she's El from Salvador. She's from El Salvador. She's from El Salvador. What is she like? She like she's is friendly. She is very funny. Very, very friendly. She <laughs> likes or she is very friendly? She is very, she is very ah, friendly. Ah, she is very friendly. So, what is she like? Como very, es ella? No she's que very le funny. Gusta. She's very friendly. Right. We funny are going too. to have the same exercise tomorrow. El mismo ejercicio mañana. But wait. I need That you to dance. be clear. Miren. Esta, creo que todas las demás... No nos cuestan, pero esta es una nueva, tal vez, expresión para algunos. What are, and we also have the expression like. What are your classmates like? What is she like? 
what is he like? In this case, as I mentioned before, we are going to have adjectives. Para responder esta pregunta, utilizamos adjetivos. Los que describen personas. Nice, friendly. ¿Qué otros tenemos? Funny. Smart, funny. Clever. Clever. Mm -hmm. Okay, smile. Nice. nice. Sweet. Yes, yeah, so what are like? Por ejemplo, los que tienen jefes, y les pregunto, what is your boss like? ¿Cómo es su horrible. jefe? What is your boss? Horrible guy. She's, she's, she's smart. My she's boss smart. is crazy. Your boss is a guy. Crazy. My, my boss is crazy. Okay, so what is like? Okay. What if I ask you about how's your teacher like? How is your teacher like? She is friendly and funny. Friendly. She's pretty. Okay. Beautiful. Mm. Pretty woman. She is corny. Pretty woman. Right? <laughs> so, yes, I accept all of those adjectives. Excellent. Teacher, residencia. Yeah, right. Thank you, Chris. Ah, Usen ese adjetivo. She is a forgetful teacher. Forgetful teacher, right? Now you know, it's not that I forget. Right? It's just that I... I speak a lot, right? Y por eso es que se me pasan las cosas. Mucho hablo. Just give me a second. You know, I even, hay clases que hasta termino afónica. Ya lo han notado a veces, right? I speak a lot. So here we go. Thank you, guys. Well, remember, this is the second class, right? Aleli, Concepcion. I am here, teacher. Ana Gabriela. <laughs> Ana Karina. Present. Okay, Anna Stephanie. Present. Andrea Isabel. Okay, Brian Edwin. I am here, teacher. Brian Isaac. Present. Carlos Eden. Present here. Great. Cesar Alexander. Present here. Cristelia Rosalina. Present. Daisy Magdalena. Present teacher. Edgardo Antonio. Eduardo Elías. Present teacher. Edwin Ernesto. Present teacher. Elvis Aníbal. I'm here. Emerson Alexander. Present teacher. Esperanza Isabel. Fátima Esmeralda. Fernando Arturo. Gabriela Lizeta. Present. Gladys Elizabeth. Present. Glenda Abigail. Present. Iris Elena. Here, Miss. Irma Raquel. Present. Gustavo Elizabeth. Present, teacher. Uh, Jasmine Yvonne. I am here. Jeremias Ezequiel. Present. And Jessica Janet. Present, teacher. Very good job. So yes, I'm missing some students today. Don't forget to join the classes, right? So questions about the platform, about the topic from today. No, ¿qué practicamos ahora? Veamos. W question. question. W H W. Spell my name. W H question with. <laughs> Bien, ¿qué más practicamos? WH questions with P. Eh, les voy a enviar ahorita la información de las WH words para que practiquen un poco más. So, if Other WH words. 
De todas, de las 10 se las voy a enviar. Right? Ok, thank you. So, if not, we are going to stop the class here. Thank you so much for joining today. Let's meet tomorrow, same you time, tomorrow. right? So, class. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye -bye. Good, night. Good night. Good night, Good night teacher. Bye. Porque solo la teacher le dice. Good night, Bye, everyone. Good night, class. Bye, everyone. Good night, everyone. Bye, bye. Ya ve, ya ve. No hace falta el chabrerío. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. No arreglen eso, tucha. Ah, sí. Good night. Sí, arreglen.